This February, more than 70,000 Bahrainis gathered and marched. The main purpose of the march was to reassure the loyalty to the constitution after 10 years of its creation and to illustrate their acceptance of the current government. The march was mainly organized as a response to the state of riot made by some citizens who were claiming illegal demands. Well, this is my first time contributing to such a wonderful uh, demonstration where it's peaceful and you can see so many people. I mean, the whole highway is blocked. Uh, we are here to stand and show Bahraini people and all the walls, uh, all the countries outside that we are with the government and with the Al Khalifa. And you are standing here and the, I think the picture shows how is uh, the amount of people here. Well, as you can see, everyone here is from... Uh... Um, all over Bahrain and uh, the news has been pretty one-sided this week um, so it's nice to see everyone come out of here uh, everyone come out here Bahraini non Bahraini Shia Sunni Christians everyone are out here and um, it's really nice to see everyone united and um, this is what I want everyone to see that Bahrain is actually united and we're one and we all live and prosper together the participants were from all ages and both genders and they were all raising Bahrain's flag and banners that contained phrases to unite the kingdom Furthermore, they were repeating phrases such as the kingdom is for all and not for a single tribe and Sunnah and Shia are brothers and the country is not for sale. That proved the big figments some channels were broadcasting. I think this one showed the world how is Bahrainis are not just one party, we are different parties and how the majority are supporting the royal family and the king and the prime minister and this is a clear indication without any rumors or any misunderstanding of how Bahrainis are there support their uh, royal families and support their government. The, the unique bit about this gathering, it's not about a certain section of society, you'll see the whole society is covered, you'll see children, women, different sex of people, old and young and we're all for Bahrain. We are in the heart of Manama, the, the center of, uh, of the, the country. It is al Fatah Highway. It's the people here coming from the neighborhoods, most of them coming walking from their houses. You can see the families, the kids, the, father, the parents. Everybody here decided to come by, by all family here to represent the, the real Bahrain community and their beliefs and, which, uh, and the government and the ruler they are supporting, which is the King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa. At the end of the day, only the truth shall be transparent like the sun. And we ask all the media around the world, globally, that they should be careful not to abuse the media. The media is more of a weapon now. It can go against you, it can go for you. All we ask is for you to say the truth, nothing but the truth. And this is the truth. It's all about peace, and we are in harmony with the government, and we are in harmony with everybody and in fact even with the other school of thought the Shia we urge them at the end of the day we are brothers and we're all sisters when asked most participants replied that they joined the march to send a call to stop the bloody Iran supported acts immediately and to assure that the kingdom is and will always remain a kingdom of unity